Are you sick of going into desktop mode to update Proton GE whenever you need to? Don't you wish there was a solution in game mode that lets you do that? Well, if you've got Decky Loader installed on your Steam Deck, there's a solution for you, and it's called the Wine Cellar. Before we get started, this video is sponsored by TomTalk. TomTalk is an innovative, tech-savvy, and fashionable design-driven brand. The Arcos bag in particular is made for the Steam Deck and ROG Ally. Inside is a protective W-shaped structure designed to protect your Steam Deck or ROG Ally from any harm. The exterior is made of recycled fabric that's also waterproof, great for transporting your stuff in the rain. Furthermore, this features special YKK zippers made to self-lubricate themselves, which means this zipper should last you decades. And when you use code TOMTALKSD, you'll get a 10% discount. Pretty cool, eh? Links in the description down below. The Wine Cellar is a fairly new Decky plugin. Its main purpose is to let you manage various different compatibility layers directly in game mode. Typically, you'd use a program called Proton UpQT to download Proton GE. But if you've got Decky Loader installed, there's another option for you. This tutorial assumes you have Decky Loader installed. If you don't have Decky Loader installed, I've got a tutorial for you. There will be a link in the description down below for a tutorial. So, once you have Decky Loader installed, go to the the plugin store. You should find Wine Cellar towards the bottom. You'll want to install it. Once installed, you'll be able to go into the menu. And as you can see here, there are multiple different options. Your dashboard shows you all of your installed compatibility layers. As you can see here, I've already installed Proton GE. But the cool thing here is that you can install whatever version of Proton GE you need. Let's say, for example, I need Proton GE 755. You just press it, and you can install it. Conversely, if you don't need it, you can uninstall it as well. But for those of you that have never watched my videos before, you may be wondering, what is Proton GE? Well, Proton GE is a version of Proton designed to help you run games that may not work properly under regular old Proton. So if you've got a game that doesn't launch properly, or maybe a game that has broken cutscenes, give Proton GE a try. And the astute among you may have noticed that there's multiple different options besides Proton GE, Lux Torpedo, and Boxtron. Lux Torpedo allows you to play various Windows games with open source versions of their engines. For example, The Elder Scrolls 3 Morrowind is a Windows game, but there's an open source version of its engine available, and there's a Linux version. Lux Torpedo sets all of that up for you very easily, and Boxtron is used to play older DOS games in a native Linux version of DOSBox. But to be honest, I'm not sure I have any DOS games in my Steam library. Nothing old enough to require Boxtron, but it's good that these options are available to you. Do keep in mind that you will need to restart your Steam Deck after installing these new Proton versions, as they won't register immediately. Yeah, it's it's a pain, but you gotta do it anyways. But first, let's talk about the pros and cons. The biggest pro is that due to its nature as a Steam Deck plugin for Decky, it's integrated into the interface. You don't ever have to leave game mode. And it's far more convenient than having to go into desktop mode to manage all of that. Yes, you have to go into desktop mode to install Decky to begin with, but that's a one-time thing. Now let's talk about the cons. There are less compatibility layers on this than there are on Proton UpQT. For example, Proton UpQT has Steam Tinker Launch, whereas this doesn't. Proton UpQT also manages Wine versions for different programs, such as Lutris. But to be honest, there's no reason why you shouldn't just use both at the same time. One interface for game mode, and one interface outside of game mode. So if you're an avid user of Proton GE, definitely pick this plugin up, you won't regret it. Also, as an additional side note, this works on Bazite as well. And I know because I'm using Bazite right now. If you like this video, be sure to press the thumbs up button and spread the good gospel of high tech low life. And if you want to see more high tech low life, be sure to subscribe and press the bell icon for notifications. And for you enlightened individuals, be sure to join my Discord server. And if you wish to support high tech low life, be sure to check out our Patreon page. Links in the description down below.